The viewers are trying to clean these TVs up. Especially this one. With the American made tube. I cannot bloody believe it. A Chinese TV with an American made CRT. I didn't realise America still made CRTs at the time this was made. It's usually the Chinese that can smash CRTs out of the factories for next to nothing. Yeah, this one's definitely a keeper. I'm going to clean this one right up. I'm going to put a circuit board out because it is filthy. And give it a good clean. And we can give it a good test. With a good signal into it. Yeah, it's cleaning up okay. I love doing that. Now there's no earth in this lead. It's just got the two there. It goes in there to the switch, then it goes to ordinary two-piece flex. It's weird what I would have used one of those though, instead of uh, using a bit less copper and just using one of these normal two-piece flex cords. Weird. Nicely shielded transformer there. Not much to these later model TVs. Really not much to them at all. Let that build up pressure. I found this one from 2003. This one. And it will clean up nice and well. And dusted it all up. It actually uh, came up quite well, that one. I just can't believe it has an American made tube there. That's unbelievable. The Chinese use an American made CRT, they couldn't make one that size cheap enough. That's surprising. Now, under this one, I've already done the back half. And this one here, the date cutter finally found it 2002, the second, 21st of the second, 2002. That's when this one here was made. Got yeah. a flat looking electron gun assembly there. Just wait for the air to press the top itself back up. This near was quite a dirty TV. It's sat under the veranda and in the back corner collecting dust and yeah, they had a lawnmower restored basically, so all the garden stuff's accumulated in it. So it's only a two-piece flex, this one. Hmm, there's the two, I think. Yeah. It must have been um slightly after that. Halfway, probably around that, that year. Later on that year, they mandated the sleeve pins on these plug tops. Sangle, 10 out to 50 volts. Anyway, it's cleaning up all right. Let's see what kind of brand this flyback is. Looks like another Yingfa. Can't really see the stickers on the other side of it. Might not be either. Yeah, you can't see the sticker on it. It has got a nice gap on it though, you can wind a nice primary in that one. Interesting. That's much cleaner. Well that's all snapped back together. You can see that I've just cut the earth off as it wasn't needed on this lead. Same on the other one. Surprisingly, why would I put a three pin three core flex? Oh the Centrex brand was about cut cost. This was a budget bloody two dollar store brand. Surprises me they actually used Overkill looks with some degree for something so cheap. That's all surprising, especially with this one having an American tube. That's got to be a bloody rare one. Anyway, let's put the backpack on and give him a test. All right, it's all cleaned up, put back together. Let's give it a test. That would be better. No remote, so they've got all the functions on here, including the menu. Obviously no um, uh, signal, no antenna. CRT cleaned up quite good. Volume 20. Well, you can do it through the menu as well. Bit of noise. 63, it's like a Panasonic one, let's go up to that number. Not sure why they'd actually access the menu to adjust the volume though. Calling on whatever that is, calendar. So I've got, got games. Check that out. No way. It's like the LG ones. Oh, look at that. Cool. I'm definitely keeping this TV. I'm not ERL on this one. 
And these, two, these sorts of TVs are worthwhile collecting. Because they've got hidden features like games. How cool is that? No sound, no. LG had this feature as well with their TVs. How cool is that? Got Tetris and built into it. What other games have we got? Oh man. Where am I getting out of this thingy? How do I get out now? Um, I just don't know how to get out of it there. I want the other game, damn it. Yeah, I might let you get out of the menu. Alright, let's see what the other game is. Better turn the volume back down before I scare the hell out of myself. Alright, we'll go to menu again. Let's go to the other game. Oops. Wrong one. Go down. Game two. Gifts. Interesting. Must need a remote for this one. Now I think I need a remote for this one. I've got to get a universe remote program to this so I can play this game. Interesting. Shows a bit of the uh, signal in the background there. I wonder how to play this game. Hmm. Yep. This TV is a keeper. You don't come across TVs like that with games you've built into them. Not many people knew that. <laughs> anyway, that's that TV tested. Let's see if this has got games on it. Set the boxes plugged in. Let's test this one. A lot less staticky and crackly after it's had a good cleaning. I wonder if this has got games. Well, that was cool. Doesn't shut down there, but I open when you turn it on. <laughs> that is awesome. Another, way, another reason why to keep this TV as well. Oh, that does have games. See, the only TVs these days that have games are smart TVs. And you have to upgrade to a smart TV in order to use the games on it. Confirm, do you? Yeah, I need bloody... I need the OK button from the remote. I can't get to the game. There you go, that's the set-top box. Now yeah, I need to get a remote plug into this thing. I want to play that game. Box puzzle. Biology clock. Interesting. A cursor. That's cool. Look at that. No way. Oh, that's, that is like, um, I've seen one of these games. I've got one of these, a game just like this on PlayStation 1. That's cool. Oh, so you put them in the, the bob in the box here, yeah, I remember this game, yeah. If I had the remote, it'd be a bit easier. Here's level 27, so you can advance to the level, whichever level you want. That stays in the box, but you got to do it in a certain order, and box all those bombs, and you'll pass the level. What's this other game it's got? Biology clock. Energy, written spirit. 993 December 11, query 2003 October 1. Yeah, that's a bit when the TV was made. So, if, okay, we'll put your birth date in, I suppose. So, if that was that, and if I put, what's a query supposed to be? How old we are, so from that age. And I was, wasn't, wasn't born there, that's not my real... Uh, let's get everything set up here. That's just an example here. Um, yeah, just as, as an example. So you put your real... Um, put your birthday, birthday in, and how old you actually are on that day. So... I'm supposed to tell you those bars have disappeared though. Say, for example, you get that much energy, that much spirit, and that much spirit. Whatever that's supposed to be, I don't know. It's some weird game. I don't know, you set your birthday and everything, and I don't know. It's just weird. But there we are. It's got some cool games on it.
I've only got two games. The LG TV, I had only had one. How cool is that? Nice sound, though. If I blow myself up. Let's go back, back, come on, change levels here. Go back to game. Oh, I changed the level now, but there we are. We have games and cool features on these things. Not bad for cheap Chinese TVs. Heh, makes them less boring, doesn't it? Anyway, thanks for watching.